Hi guys. Hi, anybody hungry? <gasps> Look at the shiners! Guys, the shiners are eating now. Look at them. I found the holy grail. <gasps> Look at that thing. Look at that thing. Bro, is that a largemouth? There's a largemouth bass in here, bro. There's so many fish, I'm telling you. Hi, hi. Oh, high five? Hi, buddy. Hello. Yeah, this guy's literally bigger than my hand. What's Gucci Raw fan? Welcome back to the most epic crazy channel on YouTube. I'm Franklin and this is Raw Fishing. Guys, we have so much going on at the Raw Fan. We have this beautiful pond right here. Now, this is an Aquascape ecosystem koi pond installed by my good buddy Greg Whitstock, the pond guy. Now, the cool thing about this pond is, is that we have a bunch of animals in there that we kind of forgot about. A long time ago, I took just a bunch of fish. I just got orange fish, blue fish, this fish, that fish, and, and we threw them in there. There was eels in there at a point in time. That There's a bunch of stuff inside of this pond. But of course, Raw fam, I'm curious to see what lived and what didn't. So before we get into this pond right here, let's, uh, let's look at another pond that we have here. You ready? Hi, guys. Hi, anybody hungry? <gasps> look at the shiners. Shiners are eating now. Look at them. Whenever we want, we could go over to my predator pond way over there and we could feed those beautiful fishies. So of course, Rob fam, we got a busy day today. We have to go inside of this pond. We're gonna take all of the water out and um, there is a bunch of bait fish in here that I've had growing. We're going to take them out from in there and put them in the according bait ponds that they need to be in. Rolf fam, if you guys haven't already, smash the like button. It helps me with the YouTube algorithm. I love you, Rolf fam. Let's do it. Whoa, what are you guys doing? I got a pump right here. We're going to start, <laughs> you guys good? We're gonna start getting this water out of this pond. Um, it's simply like that, but oh, there is thousands of baby fish inside of this pond. I threw the breadstock in there, they bred, and there's a bunch. Guys, I have no idea what we're gonna see today, but I guarantee it's gonna be cool. So, let me go right here. Come on, come on, come on. You take that right there, plug it in. All right, there it goes, look, look, look. It's a long hose. It goes all the way from here, and it goes all the way over there, and it's gonna go out, and we're gonna do a little bit of aquaponics. It's gonna, <laughs> see, the, see the trees right here? My failed attempt at a privacy hedge? Yeah, this, we got this one spurt right here. His name's Billy. Hi, Billy. Ooh. There you go. At least it's still working. We're gonna put the pump in the deepest part, and then all of the fishies are gonna go to that part. Oh my God, come here. What the heck? Is this thing alive? Yeah, this is the one problem with these. Is stuff tends to... Okay, he's alive. <laughs> stuff tends to, to get sucked up in here. Yeah, look at this guy. What the heck? is this thing? Oh, it's the plate goes from the last video. All right guys, so in the last video, we went off and we got some big, big, big plate goes. And the cool thing is they like to say hi. Hi, hi, hi. Oh, high five? High five, yeah. Deuces. Our goal is, let me see if anything else is in here. No, I don't think so. I think we're good on that one. Now, what we're gonna do, we're gonna keep draining this pond and uh, yeah, that, that was weird. I kind of saw like a little baby fin and I'm like, hmm, I should check the skimmer. So honestly, Raw Fam, at this point, we're just waiting for the water to go down a little bit. Then we're gonna start scooping. Now, I actually have like a makeshift, like little, um, I made like a PVC housing for little fish um, on my spare time. I didn't make a video. If you want, we could go make a massive one. And all of the fish are like going to it. It's like a it's like a fish structure. All right, guys. So here we go. Let's see. Okay, I see a bunch of orange fish already. Oh my God, they're so big! And we have our little structure right there. Believe it or not, off camera, I made that. The cool thing is, is that we have so many fish inside of this pond. Just hundreds of videos coming to life. All right, Raw fam. So this is how it's gonna work. We have three coolers, okay? This cooler right here is gonna be for all of the beautiful, colorful fish that we potentially wanna throw back inside of the pond. This one right here is for bait. This is gonna be anything, a cichlid, tilapia, anything like that. And then this pond over here, 
That's gonna be for mollies, platies, anything of that sort that um, we want to mass breed. Um, I got shiners in there right now, but you never know. Okay, I think it's time to start scooping, so you ready? Let's back up a little bit. Okay, let's see. I think the best goal is to get these uh, PVC pipes out first. Okay, oh, let, me, let me scoop the, the PVC up. Let's see, did we get anything? I'm gonna go like that, look down. All right, so back up just a little bit. So this PVC pipe is exactly what I installed. So baby fish can live in here. This clearly is filled with beneficial bacteria. Anything cool like that. Any baby fish? Nope. Bro, is that a largemouth? There's a largemouth bass in here, bro. There's so many fish, I'm telling you. All right, so ready? We're gonna push everything to the deep ends. And we're gonna do a big scoop. Big scoop. Oh my. I got the bass. I, look, look, I got the bass. Okay. Um, chill out, Mr. Bass. Okay, okay, chill out. Okay, the bass needs to go. Mr. Bass, chill out. What the heck is that Playco? That is a weird Playco. And this bass is so healthy, look at this. Hello, Mr. Bass. Hello, oh my gosh. Hello, hi. That's a nice bass. Look at that little buddy. Okay, so clearly we should treat this bass. He looks like he has some internal parasites, some cool stuff like that. So I'm not gonna put this in my main ponds. What I'll do is I'll put him in here, okay? He'll live in there, okay? So let's back up just a little bit. Okay, guys, look at this Playco, okay? Now, if you guys know what type of Playco, ow, ah, ah, this one's so sharp, ah. Oh my gosh. If you guys know what type of Playco this is, guys, comment down below. I remember getting this guy. Um, I went to a place called Neighborhood Fish Farm, okay? And um, a subscriber was actually there. And the, the subscriber walked over to me and said, hey, do you want some of my fish? And he gave me this along with some red tails, some this, some that. And I actually, I got this from a subscriber at like that big. Pretty cool, huh? I threw him in here, forgot about him. Look how big he's getting. So, I'm gonna throw him in there, okay? He's cool. Now these guys right here, these are baits. So this is what I really wanted to get out of here. This is just, oh my God. This is just a blue tilapia. This is a green tilapia. And this little booger right there is a green tilapia. So this is, this is what this is for. That's a bait tank. We're trying to fill that bait tank up today with as much as we can because my tiger shovel nose hybrids over there, they would devour these things. And if you guys don't believe me, I'll, I'll sacrifice one for the Rawl fam. All right, if you guys don't believe me, this is just a little green tilapia. Let's do it. Oh, hybrids! Okay, here we go. Come on. Come on. Where are we at? Come on. Oh, here we go. Come here. Ready? Come on. Uh-oh, here we go. Here we go. Wait, hold up. Guys, should I get this in slow-mo? 100%. Guys, you guys ready for a slow-mo? Let's do it. Hi, buddy. Hello. You hungry? Ready? I wasn't ready for that. I was not. Ready? I, <laughs> I was not ready. I was just literally rearranging it out of my hand and he jumped. Hello. All right, you know what that means, guys. Take two. All right, guys, take two. We got a bass out before. Let's see what else we scoop. You ready? Here we go. Here we go. Oh, come on. What do we get? Oh my gosh. What the heck is this big thing? What are you, mister? What the heck is this? Oh my gosh. Bro, I probably caught this fish as a baby. Look how big this thing is now. Wow. That is crazy ridiculous. So, this is like another fish that we're probably gonna keep. Ah. Ow, you freaking son of a gun. I'm already bleeding. Jeez. Guys, come here. I found the holy grail. <gasps> Look at that thing. Look at that thing. That thing was this big when I put him in here. Back up, guys. Back up. Oh my gosh, come here. Guys, look how beautiful this little guy is. <gasps> wow. That guy is gorgeous. All right, guys, so this is an African cichlid. This is gonna be a male. What a beautiful fish. Now, let me see. Let me check the mouth. Okay, the mouth is where they store the babies. All right, no babies inside of the mouth. I repeat, no babies. Come on. 
If there was babies, I would immediately put it in a pond by itself. All right, here we go. That is clearly one of the colorful fish inside of this pond. If you guys just saw, he did change colors a little bit. When we pulled him out, he was vibrant, like an electric blue. Put him in there, he kind of turned like a little darkish, so cool. Guys, for those of you guys that aren't believers, this fish is as big as my hand. Actually bigger, hold up. Yeah, this guy's literally bigger than my hand. This is like the perfect meal for my Tiger Shovel Nose Hybrid. What are y'all doing? I didn't even come over to feed yet. All right, I'm gonna rearrange this. This is how I wanna feed it, head first. Let's do it. And this is how they want it too. All right, let the slow mos begin. Y'all want to see that one in slow-mo? Oh my god, it's so slow. Guys, look at this. Here we go. <laughs> Woo! Dang! Guys, that thing absolutely inhaled that thing. What was that thing? Like a five, six ounce? Fish? You Probably think so? A more. Probably a little more. Eight ounces, maybe, maybe oh, even man. nine. Ooh, maybe even ten. Oh my goodness, bro. Guys, that's what I'm trying to tell you guys. My fish are crazy. They are insane. And here in the next couple of weeks, we're going to get a Jaws, a Catch the Bass, and a lot more raw fam. If you guys haven't already, smash that like button if you guys are enjoying the video. It helps me and it helps the YouTube algorithm. So let's do it, raw fam. Let's get Let's get to 10 million subs because this pawn, you guys haven't seen anything.